All right, folks. Check this out. I caught me some bait. Let's get them in the water so they'll stay alive. We're going to do some real bass fishing this morning. All right, folks. There's the first one of the day. <laughs> Just a damn baby. Let's get rid of him. We caught him using a worm. We didn't use catch him using those baits I, I've caught. So, uh, so yeah, let's, let's get rid of him. Actually, we probably could use him as bait, but we won't. We're watching that bobber. We're drinking whiskey. Now the damn sun's out, and it's freaking raining. Look, can y'all see that rain on the water? That'd be alright. We're waterproof. Folks, it's raining harder now and I ain't, still ain't catching shit. I'm just thinking about giving on up because it's, it's really raining hard now. If you can see behind me. Yeah. I mean, it ain't real, real hard, but it's a steady damn rain and there ain't nothing biting, so maybe it's just time to go ahead and get the microwave breakfast out and go inside and eat. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, here's a nice bloody one. Hooked him down deep. <laughs> Took me about an hour to get a bite, but when I finally did, that's that's the one. Good morning, folks. <laughs> I'm out here fishing this morning, and I just figured that I would uh, take this time while there ain't nothing biting. I figured I'd tell you about a couple of things that I got coming up. Let's see. Today's Wednesday. Um, but Saturday night, I'm going to the mud drag races and, uh, we'll record some stuff for y'all. Here's an example. Anyway, uh, that's what I'm going to do Saturday night. I'm going to go get y'all a bunch of good mud race footage. And then um, Wednesday morning, I'm leaving to go to Bogs and Boulders again for the 4th of July weekend. And I'm going to be recording all weekend, which is next weekend. But the drag races are this weekend. Anyhow, we're fishing. If we catch anything, I'll show it to you. And as always... Hang on, you know what's coming. <laughs> Cheers. Okay, folks, y'all know by now, if you've been watching my videos for a long time, that I like collecting logs in the lake. <laughs> ah, yeah, look at this one. It's pretty long. I've got two logs, two nice logs over there already on, you know, the back of my property. And there's just a damn piece of firewood that I didn't finish cutting that I just left there. But where I parked my canoe, I got a long, long, long one. I'm going to take this piece over there and get all the grass and shit off of it, wash it off and see what we got. This is canoe logging. Let me do that straight. Canoe logging. <laughs> All right, folks, let me show you this log. It goes from about right there to where I'm tipping my fingers at. It runs all the way, pretty much the length of that other one that I already had. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I've got all these damn logs that have been in the water, and if they're anything worth any of the money that they are on them damn television shows, I might have a good little fortune just sitting right here in my damn lake. Lunatic log. Ain't no fish today, not even one single bite. Might as well come over here and look at my tomatoes. All those. And there's tomatoes everywhere. They're all over it. Folks, this is uh, Miracle Grow potting soil that I've used on these things. 
and uh, they're growing pretty damn good. I'll show you what I've got inside here in just a second. This is what I got on the windowsill getting ripe. There's quite a bit of them in there. And today, that's how many I have down inside the brown bag getting ripe. I mean, there's a mess load of them down there. Anyhow, they are very good. They're tasty. Now, you might be asking or thinking, why the brown bag? Why some of them in the brown bag and some of them on the windowsill? Well, the ones that are red, I put on the windowsill. And, uh, I mean, they're, they're, the ones that are orange, I put on the windowsill. And the ones that are more green, I put inside the brown bag. That's just something I read in a book. If you can believe that I read a book. <laughs> yeah. It's something I read somewhere. I heard it somewhere along the way that you put the put the green ones in a plastic, uh, not a plastic bag, but a paper bag. Put a, br a brown paper bag. And then the ones that are orange, like see this one, it's, it's orange, but it's got a little green on it. Go ahead and set it in the windowsill. And what I do is I'll turn these. You know, I'll turn them and rotate them every couple of days. Yeah.